How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to more of our Starfield series. Right. Finished all of Sarah's stuff. We all are definitely Gucci right now. Um, in terms of next, quite a few missions. Vladimir might have some more temples for us, so I guess we can go see him. with you what if i can help you with anything just say the word What's wrong? i received a message from my mother a few days ago she's returned from another one of her sightseeing cruises oh well this is a surprise oh that's right i haven't really spoken about her to you have i not at all my mother lives in a fairly remote location so we rarely speak tends to keep her out of my mind that's a shame. Family is important. Sure. When you're younger. But as soon as you get older and they begin controlling your life. Oh, that's that makes sense. When you need to strike out on your own. Um, what you call control? Well, we dropped this. Three parents meant well. Oh, I'm certain they felt they were doing the right thing. You see, both of my parents were diplomats working under the flag of the UC Administrative Division. After I completed my basic education, they signed me up for a one-year apprenticeship in their department, without bothering to ask. Because they want you to follow in their footsteps. Mm. Wanted isn't the right word. Demanded would be more appropriate. For my apprenticeship, I was sent to Sidonia. My job consisted of drafting political policies and arbitrating trade disputes. The silver lining of the job was that it allowed me to spend time exploring every square inch of Mars. Sounds too bad. Um, so that's where you were bitten by the exploration bug. I was swallowed by it. Ooh. Months before the apprenticeship ended, I dumped my diplomatic certification and joined the UC Navy. Of course, my parents didn't approve. We had a huge argument. That resulted in all ties being severed between us. Um, could you bear off without them? Perhaps, but at too great a cost. You see, my father was killed during the opening shots of the Colony War. I returned to Jemison for the funeral and reunited with my mother. After that, we vowed to stay in touch. Um, how? I'm sorry to hear about your father. Oh, aren't you sweet? Always concerned with how I'm feeling. That's why I fell in love with you. Your smile, your caring. <laughs> it brightens even my darkest days. Listen, I'm going to be completely upfront with you. All this talk of family, it makes me wonder where our own relationship stands. Commitment. I'd like to spend our future together forever. <laughs> you mean that? You'd do that? For me? Yes. I've been dreaming about this moment and still... I don't know what to say. How about a yes? <laughs> yes. Yes. Of course. Yes. Ah, I just need a little time to think about the ceremony. I have some oh, thoughts about it's how married. we move forward. You know, I used to dream about finding the love of my life. And here you are. All I ever needed was you right here beside me. Oh. Oh, sorry, guys. I had. Okay. One day. Ask if you've got questions. Hate to Speak interrupt, if you have ideas. but I have a favor to We're ask. Lot of equipment on the eye has reached the span's end. If we're going to find more artifacts further out, we need work done. Got the nods and signs from Sarah and Walter for the materials, but I need hands. Perhaps to help? Won't be going alone. Need more than just the you and I. Ask around. 
A few constellations are already on their way up. Oh. I know everyone's excited by the artifacts, but we need to be as objective as possible. We speak to him again for that. Effects. Going to take a lot of hands oh. to shore up the eye. Okay. Go to the eye. No power in the engines. up some of these panels. Ah, uh, miss coming up here. We should visit Vlad more often. There you go. Down in a jiff. Let me just check a few more things. This scanning, if you could help me install these parts. Yep. There you I go. Think we are done. Thank you again. You're welcome. I'm just gonna do some more spot work. up some software. Test connection. Wanna test the computer over there? There you go. Now that is some fine tea. Perfect. Should really help whenever we need to send data back and forth from the lodge. Check a few more things. How do I get? Uh. Lend a hand. Grab a couple of wrenches and let's tighten this equipment down. Well, I'm that wasn't to happen. Right, Vladimir. Vladimir. You call it the wrong wires. Station showing red. No, it wasn't me. Invoking the guilty creed. Station's old. Fixes won't be done in a day's end, though. Oh, I should have checked the compatibility when we made the order. I can stay with you until we get all this fixed. No need for the martyr's clothes, but I'm happy to have the help. As for you, while we're giving the eye the swords, need to tip your ear on another matter when you got the time. To listen. Don't want to worry anyone, but we got more competition. Not Starborn, rival collector. Oh. Captain Petrov owns a salvager vessel called the Scow. Runs it like a palace of novelties, and he's got a new prize in An his artifact. collection. I'm it. Guessing you won't hand over easily. Reached out through my hand to hands to see if we can do an honest swap. He says the rock ain't for sale for any price. Right. I think we're gonna need the crowbar and bag for this one. Um. Say when you steal it from him. Left the life of a jacob once behind myself. I know what I'm asking. But I see a clutch prize not up for the prying any other way. Not sending you lone hook on the job. I want Barrett with you on this one. You two will be foot to foot the whole way, so make sure you're ready. Uh, 
Um, we're gonna do the other artifact before we do this one. Because we've got all these ones there. We just need to go acquire the powers. We're gonna do this one. And land there. Oh, Starfield. The jump to jump loading screen. Here. I guess I'll use... Oh, I can literally see it from here. <laughs> yes, it's the big floating stuff over there. Oh no, companion with me. there. What a dumbass I thought it was that. There's me shotgun. Here it is. Best gun. Best gun guys. You haven't used the shotguns in this game yet. Do yourselves a favour. Bloody use one. I don't know. What I have? I thought you had a jet. We know how to do these now, and a star bomb will more than likely appear once we unlock the powers of it. First, a case of finding where the door is. Look at here to me. This is distance. 
Let's travel back to the ship. Uh, we've got two new skill points. The enemies of the shock. That one done. Of course, this one. An explored route. Go jump to here first. Now we can jump. These are all temples as well, so. We're relatively straightforward, go in, do the puzzle, go the starboard, and leave. Regime and that's it there. Oh no, it's behind this. A little bit further away, this Doors right there as well. In we go.
Oh, right. What's the starborn? Where are you? We land. How's the fuel range? I jump into a close That's really weird. Okay. to do with this conflict. We don't take prisoners. <laughs> what? We're dead. We are so dead right now. are off. We are going down. It's just, it's, I'm sorry, but space combat in this game is fucking dreadful, guys. Absolute dreadful. There's no dogfight, and once they're on you, that's it. Like a fucking disease you can't get rid of.
You know what? Oh, we died again. Really follow distortions because you can see where the damn thing is. Look at it.
Right, where do we think we I think it's this way. There's two actually, isn't there? There's always two doors. I want to be here, I want to be over there. Okay, this is the last temple we have a mission for at the moment. didn't work. That was the last one we had. It was. Cool. Right. We'll head back to the ship. But guys, we're going to leave things there for this episode. If you have enjoyed it, make sure you hit that like button. Subscribe most importantly. And hope you guys have a beautiful day. And bye-bye.